In this video, I'm going to show you how you can make cute dividers for your digital planner using foil texture and patterns in the Procreate app. If you are into that stuff, just keep on watching. Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Natalia from Akaihana Art. And in this channel, I create videos about illustration, design, and creative business in general. So if you like this kind of topics, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so you won't miss anything. So as I was telling you before, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create dividers for your notebooks, journals, or digital planners using some adjustments and effects that you can use in the Procreate app to make them pretty, motivational for you and in your daily basis. Um, these are going to be September-ish, kind of autumn-like uh, designs. And once they are ready, they are going to be for sale on my Etsy store. So let's get to the sketchbook and I will show you what are all the designs that we are going to create for these dividers and I will show you a little tutorial on how you can create foil textures or cute patterns that you can use to create your own and if you are not in the mood to create your own or you're like mine remember that the link is going to be down below for you to grab them so let's get to the sketchbook and I will show you how I do it Okay, these are uh, some of the sketches that I've done uh, with these little illustrations. I'm going to create patterns and quotes and cute things for the September dividers. Remember my characters, uh, the foxy and the mouse, these are here. Okay, once you have your design, you can go here to freepit.com and grab a couple of foil textures. A 
After that, you can import them into your Procreate file and with the clipping mask, you can put it on top of anything that you have underneath. You know that the um, shape that you have underneath the texture is the one that the texture is going to adopt. Once you have your dividers, you can export them and then import them into your GoodNotes file where you have your digital planner or journal or whatever you can you want to put them on. Um, then you can resize them as your pleasure or also what you can do is that you can import them as templates. If you don't know uh, how to do that, I have a tuto video tutorial that I'm going to put on top and you can go and check it out.
So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for the lovely comments and the likes that I've been getting in my videos lately. I am so happy because it's also spreading all over my other social media, my Etsy store that is starting to pick up a little bit. So uh, from now on, I think I'm going to be creating products for back to school and fall coming up. And I hope you enjoy them. I really look forward to create uh, products and, and um, good content, valuable content for you, uh, for you to be able to learn things every day that allows you to create your own stuff. That's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching again and I will see you next time. Bye.